Hey guys, Coolio. Uh, playing Sweden 2. I think I stumbled across where I was supposed to go. I can see Nina hiding in this dark corner. <laughs> ah! Oh, dang! Uh, what'd I just say? <laughs> uh, where something? Before that, I have something to ask you. Dang. I can't believe I skipped over that by accidentally pressing a button. I need to talk to you about something, too. Good timing. Why would you... Why don't you go first, then? Uh, okay. Hey, um, Nina. Uh, is it true? Is what true? Oh, you don't mean the wandering ghost. Uh, yeah. Ha 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 ha. No, you didn't really believe that old rumor, did you? It's... it's not true? Of course not. Oh, but a lot of kids have been seeing weird shadows and stuff at night lately. It might be true after all. No way. Anyway, Nanami, how could you? I thought you were my friend. Wh what? Don't pretend like you don't know. I was hanging around Sir Flick's place yesterday, and he has someone... He loves someone who, who's always with him. It would be his sword. Well, not his sword, but the person his sword's named after. What do you mean? Wait, you don't think? I won't give up. Nanami, it's a duel. Oh, are we gonna fight? Oh, I guess it's not that kind of fight. <laughs> well, are you kidding me? You've completely lost me. Uh, is this a misunderstanding or dot dot dot? Okay. Uh, so you don't think so? Uh, you mean she may be jealous? Shouldn't we be looking for Flick? <laughs> yeah. Let's do that. So, okay, I found something, but I still have to find that other something. Which could be anywhere. Well, good. Right outside the door. Yo, sorry about that. It took a long time to get here, avoiding Nina and all. Hmm, what is it? Uh, Nina's... Oh man, how could this have happened? Don't worry though, Nanami. I'm not interested in children. Thank goodness. Wait a second, children? Alright, let's head for town. I got instructions yesterday. Where to wait for Fitcher. Um, yeah, the formation might be messed up. It is. He goes there. And this doesn't really matter that much, but we'll do it anyway. There we go. Okay, back to town. We're on the right track. Oh no, he's been found. You, you there, traitor. Look at you slinking around, all suspicious like. N no, I'm no traitor. You are, you are. I can tell from your Muse accent. You're with those bastards from Muse. N no, please stop. It has nothing to do with me. What should we do? Don, you guys wait here. Leave this to me. Hey, what's going on? Did this guy do something? Hmm. I've never seen you before. Get out of here, stranger. Well, yeah, I am a stranger here, so I don't know the whole situation, but aren't Green Hill and Muse comrades in arms? Hmm. You don't know anything. If the bastards from Muse weren't here, this never would have happened to us. They stabbed us in the back, betrayed us. This idiot here is one of them. Ah, thank the gods for the, I mean, kind traveler. Please help me. Hmm, a traitor, huh? He sold out his allies. He can't get away with this. Yeah, exactly. You understand, don't you? Oh, oh. Why me? 
I don't think this is cry. I don't think his crimes are grave enough to warrant a lynching. But why not just hack his head off? Here, you can use my sword. What I? Come on, don't hold back. You hate this guy, don't you? Am I wrong? But then, what about you? I'm with a pixel art here. I uh, no, I'm fine. Swing. Hmm. Have you no backbones? Looks like I'll have to do it. I guess that's one way to do it. I really thought that we were just going to drag him off and say we we're going to turn him in, but you know. Ha! Ah, did you see him? They turned green and ran. Hey, Fitcher, how long do you plan on staying like that? Yeah! P please save! Uh, what? I I'm alive? <laughs> I see. You found no trace of Teresa. I'm sure she must be in hiding somewhere nearby. Oh well, Don, we'll just have to return to the Academy and gather more information. Fitcher, you see what you can find out too. But be careful. I'm afraid I can't. I don't want anything like that little sin oh, scene we just had happen again. Oh, I almost forgot. The general that bought, brought Green Hill down is coming back here in two or three days. This guy knows what time it is, if you know what I mean. So be careful. I don't. I don't know what he means. This guy knows what time it is. Whew. Where should we be looking? Oh, great. They're leaving that up to me. Um, okay, I guess we go back to the academy. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Ah, Nanami, you're horrible. Are you standing between me and my Sir Flick again? Uh, I'll leave this to you, Don. Ah, uh, wait, Sir Flick, why do you run from true love? You needn't be so bashful. Whew. Are you tired? I'm tired. Shall we get back to our rooms, Don? Alright, let's do that. Um... What do you think today's supper will be? I can't wait. Let's look around a bit more. Should be fun. Yeah, maybe you're right. Wait, the supper should be fun? Yeah, maybe you're right. Let's look around a bit more. Okay, should be fun. Okay, you agree, don't you, Palika? Er, uh, and I hate spinach. It's okay. I ate it all like a big girl. Ah, <laughs> uh, Nanami. You won during the day, but our duel is just beginning. D duel? Why are you after Flick anyway? Um, is there a misunderstanding? Why are you after Flick anyway? Uh, what? What a foolish question. Why you ask? T he. What do troubadour, troub, tro, tro, how do you say that word? Troubadours? I, I'm sure I'm, I'm saying it right. I'm just not quite right on the pronunciation. Oh, yes, destiny. It's destiny. That day, that hour, I felt the hand of destiny upon my brow when Sir Flick fought in my honor. Ah, uh, I've heard the poet speak of it, but to feel it, just talking about it makes me swoon sigh. What? 
<laughs> they just wandered off. Well then, good night. Woof. <laughs> I got Shira gets to say. We're okay, right, Palika? What is it? Yeah, talking about the ghost thing. So that's like creaking floorboards, isn't it? Darn. Did you hear that? Did you hear that creep? Oh. Hey, hey, Don. Go and look. Make sure it's not a ghost. Uh, <laughs> you're awful, Don. Don't leave me here. Uh-oh. I don't want to be left behind. Let's go together. Oh. What? What? Uh, that's no ghost. Maybe it's a cat or something. Woo. Oh, that probably messed up the formation again, didn't it? It shouldn't have messed it up in a way that it matters. Actually, that's great. We're missing Flick, too. Ah, there it goes. Probably downstairs. No, no, no. I can't see anything. Nothing's there. No, no, no. Now it's gone. What's happening? Let's go back. Don, let's go. Come on, quick. Quick. Ah! I got that pretty quick. What? 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 what, what? What's this? Woo! <laughs> well, what would have happened if I'd have just gone back, though? Okay, I know where we're at. This leads inside the uh, school. Ah, there it goes. All right. It's not a ghost, then. Ah, how dare you scare a lady. I will not forgive. <laughs> the dog is not amused. Nice flick. Okay. When you hear the signal, rush in and tackle it. Woo, that's definitely a flick. Me, I'm Hunky Dory. Ready? Go! Oh, uh. You can't escape. Oh, you. Who is it anyway? What the hell are you up to? Are you insane? Flick? Uh, uh, what? Oh, I get it. Flick's been wandering around night after night like a ghost. But why would you do that? Who's been acting like a ghost? I was telling that guy, Shin, there's something suspicious about him. He's a tricky one, though. The Highland Army's after him, too, so it's to be expected. I figured he's got to be doing whatever he does at night, so I've been watching and waiting, and I just spotted him. I told him all the way here, until you showed up. And then we caught you. Huh. <laughs> yeah, no doubt. All right, now well, let's go get him. Let's just change the formation one more time. Looks like a dead end. Uh, it can't be. Is it really a ghost? Of course not. There's got to be some kind of mechanism somewhere. Let's search for it, Don. Um, click. <laughs> I knew it. 
Don, you're so cool. Naturally, you're my little brother. Come on, let's go. Wow. Did nobody else really think of that? Hey, look, we're behind the school. Can't you just walk around the trees to get here, though? What's with the secret door? Oh my, why is there, why is there two ways to go? It's not cool. Oh, where do I go? Let's go right. Oh, there's fights. It's creepers. Oh, they're called Melons, Melon Zoo? Melon Zoo. Okay, um, murder them. Wow, Shiro got three attacks. These things were evil in the first game. They could just kill a party member immediately. I feel like these guys need some levels to catch up. So getting lost isn't a terrible idea. Oh good, I picked the right way. Protect mist. That could be good, actually, if it raises defense or something. Um, right there. That scroll speed. Repels magic for all allies. So, yeah, that's pretty much what um, Anami can already cast. Is it called the same thing? Yep, sure is. Golly, Shiro just tearing people up. I love it. I think them Holly boys give much experience. Whoa, that's a new one. Uh, Monwer. Evil eye plant with teeth. It's awesome. Consider it pretty caught up in levels. Now this is kind of suspicious the way it's just a little nook, but I guess not. Oh, that cost me a fight. That'd be I. Medicine, we got so many of them. Yeah, healing is not a big issue in this game so far. Keeping people from like dying over and over is another problem. <laughs> I still never figured out what that does, but I know that the balloons stack up. Toe shoes, that's a good item. Uh, I can just do it through... Well, not equipment. It's easier to just do it through items.
What's that? He looks suspicious. That must be where Teresa is. It's got to be the ghost. Haunted shack. Woo. <laughs> anyway, let's check it out. I knew we'd be discovered eventually. However, my lady requires a bit more time here. Hey, wait, we're... Shut your mouth. We cannot forgive you, ghost. <laughs> we are your allies. I do not know who you are, so I cannot consider you an ally. I'm sorry, but I can't let you leave here alive. You refuse to listen to us? Are you after a fight? You'll find us very different from those Highland soldiers. With my blade, Tarantula, in hand, I have nothing to fear from anyone. If we're talking about reasons not to lose, we have them too, buddy. N no. Sniff. Why? Oh, look, you made the kid cry. Children, why? Oop. There she is. Wow. Shin, please stop. My lady. But these people... There... There's been enough fighting. I beg you, Shin, please stop. Wait a minute. We haven't come to capture you. I'm Flick of the Wing Army. This is our leader, Don. The Wing Army. Then I shall take your word that you are truly from the Wing Army. My lady. Even if they are from the Highland Army, we needn't do such roundabout things, Shen. Lord Don, why have you taken so much trouble, especially to see me? Um, we've come to save you. You came to save me? Why? Why? Our army's military strength is still fairly slight. Even with the aid of Two River, we aren't in a position to wage war against Highland's main army. So, Lady Teresa, we need your strength. My strength? No. What you seek is Greenhill's strength. Forgive me, Lord Don. I'm afraid I cannot help you. Why is that? I abandoned my citizens and escaped here alone. I am no longer acting mayor of Greenhill. I, uh, and I don't want anything like this, that battle to ever. It became obvious the Highland, that, oh my goodness, words. That Highland was after Green Hill, and so the citizens were preparing to fight. Highland released the captured Muse soldiers, and they came to Green Hill. At first, everyone rejoiced without knowing the true meaning of the soldiers' arrival. Highland returned the weapons and armor they had con confiscated from the Muse soldiers. They were skeptics, but most of the citizens assumed there must have been some Highland commander or other that wanted a fair fight. More than anything, the increase in military power due to the Muse soldiers was invaluable to the morale of the dejected citizens. Before long, the Highland army appeared, and the citizens prepared for battle, however. The Highland army began their siege, but made no move to attack. The addition of the Muse soldiers had nearly doubled Green Hill's army, and the food supply was now decreasing with alarming speed. Soon enough, the soldiers and the citizens were at odds over the dwindling provisions. The Green Hill citizens thought, this is food for Green Hill. 
but the Muse soldiers considered it food for fighting. Oh wow. So gave them extra soldiers to make the siege easier because they didn't have proper supplies. And so the Muse soldiers rebelled, taking the food storehouses by force, throwing the city into chaos. It seems obvious now that Highland must have given the Muse soldiers back their weapons for just this purpose. And then we, right in front of the Highland army, we were defeated without even having, a, having fought. That is what happened. Comrades in arms killing each other over mere food. All that remained in us was distress for each other. And I was acting mayor of Greenhill. I, as acting mayor, could not prevent this. Forgive me. Lord Don, I can't help you. Please, please, return home. Excuse me, but you should leave Greenhill as soon as possible. And I'm not saying I distrust you. But if the Highland Army discovers Lady Teresa's whereabouts, I will hunt you down. <laughs> Don't threaten us. You're called Shin, right? What do you plan to do? You can't hide here forever. We need a bit more time here. Lady Teresa wishes it. Gosh. We came all this way and found Teresa for nothing, I guess. Yeah. Looks like this was all pointless. Don, we'll leave Green Hill tomorrow. Too bad, it was fun. <laughs> Morning, Don. So today, we say goodbye to this school. It was fun, kind of, and the food was delicious. I don't know. Maybe Teresa's gonna go directly after their commander, Joey, when he shows up. Oh, that's her plan. Or maybe she'll just give herself up. Are you sure you didn't forget anything? We won't be back here anytime soon, you know. Uh, I'm ready. Hey, Flick, you're not gonna say goodbye to Nina. Don't be ridiculous. Now that you mention it, I haven't seen her since this morning. Well, it was nothing to do with me. Come on, let's go. Oh, we're gonna end up having to save her again, aren't we? And uh, in doing so, cause her to fall in love for Flick with Flick forever. I want to check inside here and talk to the receptionist again real quick. Okay, now. What? What? <laughs> What's... All right, listen up. This is an announcement from the Prince of Highland, Luca Blight. 20,000 potch and the right of Highland citizenship will be awarded to whomever, whomever captures Teresa, former acting mayor. Liar. That's right. How can we trust a nation that's already broken their promises? Yeah, yeah. A cash reward and immunity. It's only a matter of time before someone comes forward. What is it, Polika? No, that's a lie. How dare you? If you won't trust us, then... There he is, Joey. Citizens of Green Hill, please listen to what I have to say. 
The parties responsible for yesterday's unlawful investigation are already being punished. This is a formal offer from Prince Luco Blight of Highland. I swear on my own life that our promises will be kept. Is it really? There is, however, one condition. Teresa must be delivered alive. No reward will be given for a corpse. Tw 20,000 potch? Why? Why? What is Joey doing here? Uh, Paliga? Oh no. Hey, wait. Damn it, you brat. Uh, we have to follow her. Okay, let's go. What? Who's this? Little girl. Huh? You're... You. Um... Should I say something, Joey? Why are you? Or just stay silent? Let's stay silent this time. Hey, get them. They're... Hey, you people, capture them. Spies, they're spies. Though there will be rewards. Damn, quickly, get them. Out of the way, damn you. Don. Golgan, Colgan. That's the leader of the Wing Army, isn't it? The one that defeated Kiba at Two River. You're sure we shouldn't follow, Commander? Raud will take care of it. We'll leave it to him. Naturally. Teresa, no matter what you say, we won't give her up. I suppose so. Still feel like Joey's still on our side. He's got his reasons. Over there. Tisk. I don't know. She's still ballooned. Um, ah, we'll heal up real quick. Uh, that one. And then attack. Oh, wow. I just noticed how far we went over in time. Because I got distracted by all the story. We'll murder these people off real quick. So what if it's a 33, 34 minute video? <laughs> but yeah, that did clear blue. And I was thinking that before I got distracted again. Good. Okay, so we'll end here. And then I'll see you in the next episode. Later.